recreating it and uh, selling it to friends and people I knew. Um, then I went off into design school and started doing um, various designing hats and started doing florals and eventually led to doing jewelry about nine years ago. So I've been working on doing things with copper and bossing and fusing fine silver and getting into stamping on jewelry. And My website is beautifulthingjewelry.etsy.com. Um, I've been working on getting more products and stuff on there, but if you go on my Facebook page, you'll see a lot of different um, pictures of my jewelry that I work with and working with different <laughs> gemstones and doing copper, and you'll see various things on it. <laughs> 
Hi, my name is Jackie. I am the creator of Lavender Avenue, it's a line of all natural skin care and items for the home. I started doing this a couple of years ago to honor my mother who I lost to cancer um, when she was still alive. We went on a journey and we, we decided to clean it up because we learned about all the chemicals that are in everything, our food, our skin care and so on. So we started making um, our own stuff and uh, it just kind of grew. My friends would say, hey, uh, I want some good stuff too. <laughs> so. Um, came a time I would found myself making 24 face washes in one night and I thought, okay, it's time to do something with this. So um, I did. I decided to share it and the line has grown. Um, and I, I really enjoy what I'm doing. I start with a, an all natural vegetable base um, product. I add essential oils and vitamins to it. I use absolutely no chemicals or artificial colors or anything. So I'm able to offer a pure product um, to my customers. And, um, I do it in-house. I'm not paying a huge overhead. I, I bring it straight to the people through events like this and public uh, markets, which keeps the cost down. So it's not only good for you, it's also affordable. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my website. <laughs> the website is www.lavenderab.ca. So, yeah, so it's um, fantastic that we offer those um, products. So one of these are going to be the one that you have to market. I shouldn't say advantage of it, but we actually use three different varieties from the everywhere else. So it's a much more pointless. We've got patents, all our we've got like 12 patents. Is it like a franchise? It is a network marketing. <laughs> Are you looking for a business opportunity? No, I'm not. No, not really. No. Yeah, it is a way to, to earn extra income if, okay. if you want to. Yeah. So, but you can also just be a customer if that's what you want. Hi, I'm Diana Beckwith from Karma High. I'm originally from San Diego, California. I moved to Vancouver about six years ago. I say the mountain spirits called me here because the beautiful spiritual energy of this space is what really drew me and my attention. And from here, I was able to go to art school where I got my degree in photography but moved on to the spiritual community where I started working with sacred art, jewelry, uh, smudge fans, indigenous cultural wisdoms. Um, I've done many ceremonies in different places including Costa Rica for moon dance ceremony and some of the pieces that I have here incorporate my travels they incorporate recycled materials, found objects. For example, these smudge fans here, these beautiful smudge wands I create are all naturally found and collected feathers. There are no store-bought feathers from anything that I produce because I believe in like the naturalness of life. And they definitely love protecting wilderness and Mother Earth. So this is for smudging and cleansing when you're doing your smudge. Uh, you want to bring this energy in, which brings in the heaven energy to Earth. So this is good for when you're doing cleanses for the body. Um, as here as well, I have smudge blends from things I've collected and harvested naturally. For example, this is uh, grandmother sage that I collected naturally from BC and from the mountains here of Vancouver, uh, cedar leaves. It's a wonderful blend that you can use to for your smudging and cleaning processes. So as you can see here, there's cedar leaves and then there's also some beautiful grandmother sage in there. You'd have to kind of smell it to get the real experience. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so I do sewing as well. I make beautiful pendants, for example. Everything that I have has a story. This is from Mexico. This shell was found on the beach. Uh, from my travels, I spent four months in Mexico. Uh, these ones here are from Costa Rica. <laughs>
So I say I'm an intuitional artist. So anything that you're drawn to is usually something that your spirit is being called to. So if you're being called to this piece and you don't know why, and I tell you this is from California, maybe you have a connection to California. Maybe there's something that your spirit is really calling you to. And this is why you've chosen this piece. So again, everything that I do here is intuitional. Um, and yeah. That's a part of who I am, it's a little bit of my company and a little bit about my spirit. Namaste, aho, omate. Oh, and my website. <laughs> My happy website, beautiful website, is www.karmahai.com, but you can also find me on Facebook. Uh, Namaste. <laughs>
even with this like feather earrings that I've done here and I also make my own 108 feet mala beads here and you can find me at pocketvenusjosan.org so my uh, brand name is uh, Pocket Venus Joseon Sacred Treasures so I, I'm looking forward to hearing from you guys yeah, I have one of those from India. Oh, do you? Of the same Same. I brought, bought it last year. Oh, I took it in. in to, you bought it in India? No, I bought it here. Oh, you bought it here and took it to India with you. Oh, do you have do you have the replacement cartridges for it? Uh, I. How often do you need to replace? Um, it depends on kind of water you're using. Like if you're using wherever the country you're in, and you water. You need to test it with a few straws and see what the alkaline alkalinity of your water is. So, do you sell those things for us? Yes, we do. Yeah. <laughs> How much? I think they're about nine dollars for <laughs> And the uh, and the cartridge is one twenty nine. You get three of them. Oh. So they last about. Um, and how much is this? I remember I bought it for one ninety nine. One ninety nine. But uh, we're selling it for one seventy nine today. Today? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. So this water is this water? This is this water here. This is the BioSera. This tests out at um, 9.5. So you can see between 10 and 9.5. Um, this is the Fiji water. If you're going to buy bottled water, then buy something that's a little bit better. That tests out at about a 7. This is Smart Water. This tests out at about a 6. This is the Sani water, and it tests out like a pretty acidic 4. And Aquafina, that's about a 4. And then that's pop, which is like three, hmm. very acidic. This is, uh, this is tap water. The debit card? Um, yeah, I do on PayPal. Ah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I just have to go onto my computer and get all that. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> you want to ask me a question? <laughs> uh, basically, this is a bio sera. It's sera water, and it is uh, alkaline water pitcher. And they use it to um, you put tap water in it or whatever water that you have, and it, it works like a four thousand dollar water machine. So it alkalizes the water, adds um, minerals, oxygenates the water, um, adds uh, all of calcium, magnesium, everything that you need in the water. It has bioceramics in it, so it's like this bioceramic type of material in the little beads and crystals as well. So it emulates a water going over like rocks like in the uh, mountain stream, so it's really close to nature. So um, and what they do with the, the bioceramics is they heat, they heat them up to 3,000 degrees nine times to make it like, it so that the water just goes up, there's no leaching, so it doesn't leach any chemicals into the water um, or any aluminum or anything like the other products that might do with them as well. And you don't have to use any like chemicals or you have to plug it in. You just put the water in there, so it's really economical, and uh, it's beautiful tasting water. It's like making the mountain fresh water. <laughs> and uh, if you're interested in trying uh, BioSera, you can go to vipswellnessjourney.com, and I'm on, um, I have water and plus other products as well. So thank you. Hi, my name is Christine Payton and this is Stonehaven Gems. We are Stonehaven Gems. Um, you can find us at stonehavengems.com. You can also find us in Vancouver and Victoria and around the Lower Mainland and Vancouver Island at a variety of gem shows, wellness events, sometimes at the Schwartz Bay Ferry Terminal, um, and so on. <laughs>
made you decide to get into this? This was, uh, this was a divine accident. Um, I studied the healing arts, and I guess it worked, because around 25, everything kind of fell apart, and I woke up one morning, and I thought to myself, I could go to that crystal store and go to work every day, um, where I went to work every day for six years, and then finally went to my first Tucson gem show. And that was when this sort of started, where I brought back a small collection because I wanted to get out of the store and go to music festivals, and that was six years ago. And I feel super blessed to be the carrier and keeper. I always say I'm just a strong back, and I listen, so they're, they're the bosses. And uh, I'm about to embark on a crystal digging mission through Alberta, Montana, Colorado to go to the Denver Gem Mineral Show and get a new collection, come back and do it all over again. And your website? Stonehavengems.com. You can find us on the lower mainland of BC and on Vancouver Island. I'll see you there. <laughs> Hi, I'm Marguerite, <laughs> and the style I'm doing here is a Japanese bodywork called Ohashiyaku. It's a very, very special kind of bodywork, uh, far beyond Shiyaku, which is point. So, um, it's a combination of many things, but mainly, and what I like so much about it is, that it's beneficial for the receiver, and very relaxing, very healing, but it's also beneficial for me. So, whatever I'm doing is helping me to get better and I feel better after the session. So I want to show a little bit how I do it to demonstrate how this can be. My master, uh, Wataru Ohashi, is, has created this especially for the giver. So it's a very special technique. I I'm leaning. I use her. I get support from her. And I'm calling. That's how I don't use any extra energy. I am relaxed, I'm in tonus, which also gives me the opportunity to really feel I'm not tense. Everything I'm doing is just leaning. No I use gravity and I move my heart, my center, 
I'm just being present with her. It's not so much doing, it's more being here. <laughs> being together with my partner, being supported and giving support at the same time. The healing is her I'm just helping. She is the healer. And I combine different techniques. Going from one to the next in a continuous cycle, like everything in nature is continuous, and that's how it becomes a nice continuous dance, like Tai Chi, but not alone. <laughs> Where can we find you? I'm working in two different studios downtown. One is the Glow Acupuncture Center at Nelson at Homer. One is the Electro Health Floor at Gerard and Nelson. <laughs> but I'm also teaching. Okay. I'm teaching this style, actually, uh, I have a school in Vienna and now also in Vancouver to teach this style. And, well, I think this is the real work, to learn it by yourself, for yourself, because it's for you. And it helps to get better and better. And in the end, everybody is happy. She is happy and I am happy. So your website is? www.ohashiyatsu.org Ohashi is the master and this is why it's called Ohashiyatsu. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you.